This is Kevin with Trenchless Innovations. Today we're out in Glen Ellen, Illinois. We're working on some underground air ducts again. You see we're looking into a plenum box now, which is a metal box that's heavily rusting out. In this system they have a concrete pipe with metal connectors and elbows throughout the entire underground system. We will be applying our trenchless cast mortar system to all the bad metal fittings and elbows. The pipe itself is a concrete pipe. So we'll be hitting all the metal connections and elbows with our trenchless cast mortar system. And once we get it all mortared and solid again, we'll be applying two coats of our rubberized duct lining material throughout the entire system. This is Kevin with Trenchless Innovations. We're still out in Glen Ellen, Illinois. We just finished our trenchless cast mortar portion of the underground air duct restoration. See here we've got the entire plenum box remortared. Our trenchless cast along with all the metal elbows, couplings and fittings throughout the entire underground system. Now that we've got them all concreted, we'll let the concrete dry, give us a nice strong pipe to work from. And we'll encapsulate it all with two coats of our duct lining material throughout the entire system. Okay, this is Trenchless Innovations. We're back in Glen Ellen, Illinois. Uh, we already applied our trenchless cast mortar to the underground air duct system to give it a strong structure. Now we just applied our first application of our rubberized duct lining material to all the underground air ducts to completely seal the system. Take a look up each run. These were completely rusted, heavily rusted, with heavy sand and debris falling into the line. We'll come back in another week and uh, give it a second coat.